up and I'm alone again Calls miss ringing on my phone again And I'm lifeless in the white mist And the walls of my mind are closing in And now a dark death is breathing And it's breathing By the sound of these Americans dreaming My head's pounding My heart's screaming Never again Or maybe one more time Never again Do you ever see hope in their eyes? Yeah. And then what, what's triggering that? Like, what's like the. Can we try to A tap lot of into times, that? I think it's just like somebody telling them that they matter. In talking with Mr. Maniakis, we learned that the students use a variety of art forms to voice their inner struggles, so our focus became finding the best possible outlet to allow them to creatively express themselves. It would be game-changing to also have local graffiti artists to assist in creation of the mural and to further empower and inspire the students to take control of their own experiences through art. Specifically, local artists Truth and Mez Data collaborated with the medical school this past fall on a public mural illustrating the school's vision for a healthy Austin. This relationship could be leveraged in order to raise this project to another level. It would also be game-changing to organize a school-wide event to coincide with the completion of the mural and to invite local spoken word and artistic performers to facilitate creative expression for the student and offer mentorship opportunities to the students. These mentorship opportunities would give the program ongoing impact. We were surprised to find that our contact from the school voiced enthusiasm for the mural rather than focusing on psychoeducation. Previous psychoeducation presented to the students was not effective in reducing their drug use or inciting healthy conversation. After speaking with a teacher at the school, we found it interesting that students felt most empowered when they were allowed to share their opinions and were made to feel like they mattered. After discussion and reflection among the group, Team for Health proposes an art therapy intervention consisting of a collective student mural on the campus of Austin Can Academy. This collective painted mural aims to enable Austin Can Academy students to connect through a common bond of experience, provide a sense of strength and hope, while nurturing a mutual support group through expressive art. Students would paint a mural to express how substance use, whether current or in recovery from, has affected their lives. Bruce Moon, author of Essentials of Art Therapy and Practice, states that art therapy boosts the flow of positive emotions to induce more hope, mobilize client strengths and inspiration, and perhaps the most important, to induce love, life purpose, and meaning. This mural reads, Knowledge is Power. For this, it's the knowledge of drug use, substance disorders that can be expressed artistically by Austin Can Academy students. It's an important topic in healthcare where the problems are many but solutions are few. It's an important topic in humanities that affects many individuals around the world. So why not start here at Austin Can? Mr. Manicus told us, there are kids here seizing on K2 in class and at bus stops, but for some reason we'd rather focus on kids who have their shirts untucked. Let's tackle this issue starting now.